Now let's solve this if we can. So if we can. If the square root of x squared minus 36 is equals to 8, what is the value of x? 97% will fail. Really. For us not to be part of this 97% who failed. Let's solve this. By the way, hindi ako ang original na gumawa nito at hindi ko alam kung sino na ang original na gumawa nito. Pero it looks like uh, this is written from our uh, mga friends sa uh, India. It looks like. Please try to answer this first before you will see our solution. rewrite lang natin and this is, is square root of x squared minus 36 equals 8. Next is we have to square this entire equation para mag read natin itong uh, square root sign. Now, erase na to. So, ang natitira na lang x squared minus 36 equals 8 squared. 8 times 8 and that is 64. Now, minus 36, kapag i-transpose mo sa kabila, that will be plus 36. So, 64 equals 36 equals 100. So, this is x squared. So, x squared equals 100. But the question is, what is the value of x only? So now we are going to do square root for this entire equation. Itong x squared equals 100. So square root. So now this is cancelled. So x only. Square root of 100 and that is 10. So the answer here is 10. But wait! Square root of 100 is not just positive 10. It is positive negative 10. So the correct answer here is positive negative 10 and not just positive 10. It is positive and negative 10. Now let's double check. Double checking tayo. Erase muna natin ito. Square root of x squared, so let's use the positive 10. 10 squared minus 36 equals 8. 10 squared is 100 minus 36. And then pa yung square root equals 8. 100 minus 36 and that is 64. So square root of 64. So obviously square root of 64 is 8. How about negative 10? Now, this is how you are going to write negative 10. Square root of negative 10 squared. Negative 10 dapat nakas nasa loob sa parenthesis squared. Remember, negative 10 squared both nasa loob ito sa parenthesis. Kung ganito lang, this is negative 100. Dapat nasa loob ng parenthesis because it says x is equals x squared. Okay? x squared meaning kung ano yung value ni x mismo. Kung ang value ni x ay negative 10, okay? Dapat nasa loob ng parenthesis si negative 10 bago ni raise ng 2. Yan yung value ng x. So kung x squared, that means you see x squared means x times x. So, if x is equals to negative 10, okay, dapat na sa loob ng parenthesis para maging negative 10 times negative 10. Uulitin ko. Again, again, again. Negative 10 only, this is negative 100. So negative 10 should be inside the parenthesis before you raise to 2 
and that is positive 100. Okay. Let's go back to the equation. Negative 10 raised to 2 minus 36 equals 8. Negative 10 raised to 2. Negative 10 nasa loob ng parenthesis. Kasi yan yung equivalent ni x mismo. So negative 10 times negative 10 and that is 100 minus 36 equals 8. So this is the square root of 64 which is really equals to 8. So therefore, ang sagot na negative uh, positive negative 10 ay tama. If you have any question, just comment down below. Thank you for watching.